Look out from behind. Sheamus just blindsided King Corbin's scheduled opponent. This is broken out into a battle of kings. And only one king is going to bend the knee. The WWE Universe on their feet. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 470 pounds. The King, Nathan Mercer and King Booker. So much has changed for this superstar since he completed his training with Booker T. A former indie competitor, he left Houston a new athlete and set course full steam ahead for WWE. Guys, we're about to see a fight. I've been waiting a long time for this. And their opponents first from Dublin, Ireland, weighing in at 267 pounds, the Celtic warrior, Sheamus. He has got to be in the best shape of his life. And the worst mood of his life as well. Betrayed Drew McIntyre, Cesaro, and the entire WWE Universe. Well, luckily, the Irishman's powerful enough to fight all on his own. Bend the knee before your king. He's not my king. And from Kansas City, weighing in at 275 pounds, King Corbin! Corbin looks ready to dispatch any threat to his crown. Corbin always ready to use questionable tactics to gain success. That's not so despicable if you understand how to respect such a majestic and valiant ruler. And now Corbin is here to claim his most regal victory 
to date. This match is underway as King Booker and SmackDown's reigning King of the Ring take on King Corbin and Sheamus in a battle to determine SmackDown's one true king. It's a full house of kings here on SmackDown. The full house is actually when, you know what, never mind. Saxon, you want to play poker after the show? Hey, that sounds great. Thanks, Corey. Oof, where's the haymaker? And a tag there. Ah, suplex. Oh. oh, my! Wasting absolutely no respect on his opponent. You got to love it. Suplex, perfect. He's taking some good hits. Into the corner. This can't be good. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Definitely not where you want to be right now. Just carried like a ragdoll here. Just mounted with punches. And not, oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. He's in off the tag. Return fire on the Celtic Warrior. Oh, the mist! The mist are blind! Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Put it down across the back. He has a task at hand, but prefers to be showboating right now. Cuts him off. Kick, right on point. Spotted Buster. He's getting a huge boost right now from all those chants and cheers. Sheamus' face. There he goes, right into the corner. Oh, oh, oh what a boot. Look at the counter. Yeah. Oh, flipping the script on him there. Oh, what a kick. The fight is being taken to Sheamus. And overlifting Booker T here. Kick to the midsection. Booker take this kick. Can you dig it, Saxton? Shane is going to feel that one tomorrow.
Things are getting risky. This will not end well. Electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. And he stonewalls Corbin. Now the heel kick. Ooh. This match is brutality starting to show on him. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner up. Oh, there it is. Book in. Will that close things for Booker? Gets tagged in. of Baron Corbin after witnessing what we just saw. That was the home run shot that got right. Strenuous effort here. and King Booker. And these two really do make the perfect pair. That was a great example of what a tag team can do when it's firing on all cylinders. One of the best superstars around. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by King Booker from the City of Angels. Weighing in at 219 pounds, the King, Nathan Mercer. This athlete was hampered by nagging injuries when he competed on the Indies, but looks to be in tremendous shape tonight. We're looking at a competitor who battled adversity to get here, and he's not going to take this for granted. A competitor with his share of detractors, but he wants to prove them all wrong here tonight. Bend the knee before your king. He's not my king. And no disqualification, no countouts. We're guaranteed to see a trainload of carnage before this one is through. Yeah, this is the type of match where grudges get even uglier. You never know who or what will come out of the woodwork in a battle like this. Well, that's when some outside... Going airport! The cover. Let him have this moment. He's earned it. Nasty. Oh, God. Stomping. Ouch. And Corbin with a counter. Yeah. 
These two showing how well scouted they each are. Oh, what a kick. Ooh. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. And Baron now is being chopped down. Corbin has been snuffed out. He went right into that turnbuckle. Inverted tree of woe position now. Corbin dodges that one. Precarious position for both superstars. Oh, gosh. Back suplex on the apron. He now just looks helpless to every attack. Yeah, he has to devise some kind of new strategy here. And he goes into the ring. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Great power. Inverted suplex. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Springboard. Oh, no. Crashing hard onto the floor. Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. That haphazard approach definitely proved costly. Into the ring again. Oh, and Corbin is being handled here. Corbin might just be waiting for an opportune time. Oh, look at this here, guys. Look at this. Back suplex into a pump. Will be ended here. And kicks out before the refs count. He didn't even let the ref start the count. And that can vanquish Corbin. No, no, their eyes, their eyes. Oh, was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was as one-sided as it gets.